Hello everyone, welcome to McKenzie Creations. In this video, I just wanted to go over some of the Valentine cards that I made up. Um, I had a request to make some cards, so I actually did um, a digital card, which I won't show on the video because it's a personal card. But these are more general, and these are handmade cards that I um, made up. So I just wanted to go over with you what I made. Um, because I thought I was going to be able to get a few more done. However, um, time just got by and it's going to be my work weekend coming up. So, um, yeah, let's just get started with what I made here. Um, this card is a slumline card and it was made using the Spellbinders card of the month. Um, this is the large die for January. So I'll just bring over the die so you can see it. And um, I'm on a subscription for the small month um, kit, um, die. However, this was so cute. So I went ahead and got this one. And, um, you know, you, you can, this is the base of the die. And then they have all these little heart um, die inserts that you can um, cut out as well. So I'm not going to take this all off. But, um, yeah, you can check it out on Spellbinders um, website. And then they have all these little dies to go along with it if you want to use for your card. So, um, yeah, I thought that came out really nice. And I used like a marble paper that I had for this die. And then um, I just added this little sentiment on here. I actually put these up on my website, McKenzieCreations.design, as a free download. Because I didn't have any sentiments that just said Happy Valentine's Day. So um, let me just push this up a little bit so you can see. So I think this card really came out nice. And then for the inside, I just have like um, just a general Happy Valentine's Day. Um, let's see, I turn it this way. And I also have this on my website as a download. And so actually I just cut this down since I had it on white paper. And then I layered it on some marble paper to match what I had on the front of the card. And so I think that came out really nice for the inside. And then that's the outside of the card. So yeah. So let's move on. Um, the second card that I worked on, well, it's, it's in no particular order, but this card, um, I wanted to try the Anna Griffin purse die out. So um, I made this little card here and here is the die set for the Anna Griffin um, purse die. And these were, I normally use my manual cutting machine, but these dies are a bit larger. So I had to pull out my um, electric machine to create this card. So you had to use these two sets to get this card here. So this is um, Anna Griffin. And then I just added some felt stickers from the dollar store, just um, some hearts. And then in the inside, you know, I just put a little sentiment in here. So it says, hey, Valentine. And I added some little stickers that I had from the dollar store. So this is cute. Just a little cute little dainty purse die. Okay. The next few dies I did was using... Um, a diamond press die and I decided I wanted to make some shaker cards so I thought this came out so cute and I'll get this set from diamond press let me get this out I don't think I have the paperwork in here um I don't know oh here it is let's see let me just open this up. Okay. Oh, sorry about that. I'm just trying to find what the name is. Hmm. Well, I know it's like it's like a paw kit because it has the animals on here. And with the cards I made, I didn't use the animal um, dies. They have the little cute, um, I guess this is um, 
I know this is a dog. These are dogs. And maybe a little cat right here. And then this looks like a little lion and a little cat. So this is a cute set, but actually you can do a lot with this set. And you don't, and I didn't use any of these dies, but let me just show you what came in the kit. So it's the dies um, to cut out the little animals. And then this is what I use. This is the base of the um, slimline card. And then these are the um, actual stamps. Let me see. Um, I don't have a piece of white paper with me. Let me just see if I can hold these up. Um, well, it's um, a bunch of sentiments on here. Um, so, and then these are the little cute animals and they're so cute. Um, but like I said, again, you can use this kit for anything. So, um, I um, wanted to use it for Valentine's Day. And um, so let me just go through my cards I made. Um, I made up this little cute shaker card. And um, this is using Beth Kingston um, paper pad. So um, that's the base layer that I use. So that's a pretty little paper. And then, of course, I used the diamond press die to cut this out. And then I made it into a little shaker card and all these little elements I have in here I uh, purchased from the dollar store so um, yeah don't count them out they have a lot of great craft supplies just to um, build up your stash and so um, yeah I got these little stickers and then the inside of the little um, confetti I uh, purchased from the dollar store and then right here it's just another card. Um, this is just a different layer paper from Beth Kingston. Um, so yeah, I thought that was really cute. So a little shaker card. I love shaker cards. <laughs> and then I thought this one was really cute. Um, I took these little, um, you know how we had the candy back in the day with the little sentiments on the candy. Um, so I made this slimline card and it's actually using Beth Kingston paper as well and then um you know I use the diamond press die and then these little um these are stickers from the dollar store I didn't take the back of the stickers off so I just wanted them to they this doesn't really shake but um I just thought it was cute in the inside and I didn't put any type of sentiment on here because I just thought it was cute like it is. And then for the inside, I just use, um, you know, a general sentiment. Happy Valentine's Day. I do have these available on my website for download. And then I just added some more little um, stickers on here to go with the front theme. So I thought that really came out cute. Oh, and then going back to this card, I forgot to show the inside of the card. So it's just basically the same and I put a little heart in it. So I just wanted to come and show you all of the cards that I made this week for um, a Valentine's request. And so I hope whoever gets them it enjoys them. Um, these were handmade cards made with love. And um, yeah, so I'll be working this weekend, but um I hope everyone has a great Valentine's Day. Take care, everyone. See you in the next video.